Cinco Trece, or Trece Trece, or Doce Doce. Right, we're going to pick one of those. Anyway, good morning, Double R Radio, live on Facebook right now. Good morning. It's the Robert Evers Radio Familia, Double R Radio Familia. There we go. Um, hey, how about those Houston Astros? Woo-hoo! Houston Astros kicking ass. That's right, the Houston Astros are kicking ass right now. Anyway, <laughs> they are, man. You know, my only problem with all this, the only problem with... I live in San Antonio. I've got, uh, what the hell do I got? Uh, Spectrum. Time Warner Cable. Spectrum. And those sorry mothers, they don't pick up Houston National Baseball. They don't, man. Man, it's a cop. And that's really, man, it pissed me off. You know, mm-hmm. what do they need to do? I mean, should I get involved with the talks and let's get the Houston Astros fans backing me up? And I need help here, man. We got to get Houston National Baseball here in San Antonio. It sucks, man. It's terrible. It is, man. Man. You're probably going, wow, Robert, why'd you wake up so pissed off this morning? Well, because, man, I was trying to watch Houston National Baseball illegally. Illegally. And if I get thrown in jail, it's their own fault, man. Hey, come on, man. I want to watch Houston Natural Baseball. Man. <laughs> You're probably going, Robert, settle down, Robert. Calmate, Roberto. Calmate. Anyways, <laughs> good morning, Thursday morning. Is Do not forget tomorrow morning is Freeform Friday. Of course, it's an, everybody loves Freeform Friday, but tomorrow morning is a special mm-hmm. Freeform Friday. Why? Because it's going to be the 80s. We're going to play a lot of Who's we? I'm going to be playing a whole lot of 80s music. We're going to go down memory lane through the 80s tomorrow morning on Freeform Friday. That being said, um, I've been watching the show on Netflix. I don't know if you got Netflix or not, but you need to check this out. I've been watching a show called um, Ice People. Have y'all ever heard of this? Ice People. Good morning, shout out to Deborah Camarillo, joining me from Anaheim, California. Good morning, Deborah. You know, one thing I simply love about Deborah Camarillo, look here, check this out. It's 7.44 in the morning, right? Here in San Antonio, here in this, uh, Central Standard Time. But over there, on the on the West Coast, it's, uh, it's 5.44. 5.44 on the West Coast. And she's waking up and joining me on my morning show. Woohoo! Thank you, Deborah. Good morning. There we go. Good morning, shout out to Cindy Martinez Hernandez. Come in. There we go. Anyways, wait, what you put? Huh? What's this, Robert? Oh, yeah, the 80s. Cindy's going, the 80s. Woohoo! Anyways, um, I've been watching this show on Netflix called Ice People, okay? And let me tell you, man, this show, it's really good. It's a series, but it's really good, and I'm going to tell you why. Um, on Ice People, it's about people that live up in Alaska, up there, but even further north. They live out there in the snow, the ice, the blizzards, all of that. No lie. I'm not making this up. And it's really cool, and it shows how these people survive out there in the wilderness. That's the way they want to live. You can probably go, well, Robert, why do they want to live like that? Because that's the way they want to live. People live the way they want to live, right? They live up there in Alaska because they want to live out They want to live off uh, the... <laughs> they want to live off the land, you know, and part of <clears throat> part of living off the land is um, they get to, uh, they don't have H-E-Bs or stuff like that over there. They got to kill their own meat, okay? I mean, kill, well, yeah, they, they got to kill whatever animals they're going to want to eat, right? The meats, you know, pork chops and steaks and all that. That's the way they do it. And what's so crazy about it, that some of these people, there's one couple, it's a man and a woman, and uh, Jesse Serata, buenos dias, amigo, buenos dias, Mr. Jesse Serata, there we go. Anyways, one of these crazy things about being up there, uh, a couple living in Alaska, is that they got the woman. Check this out, ladies. Check this out, ladies. This is what pisses me off. I can't even get a woman to iron my shirt, okay? I, you know, nowadays you tell a woman, uh, honey, uh, baby, me planches la camisa, por favor. That's pendejo! You iron your own shirt! Man! Hey, but honey, I took you out for steak! I bought you margaritas! I took care of business! You want to iron my shirt? No! Toy pendejo! Well, I guess toy pendejo. But these women in Alaska, check this out! These women in Alaska, now, that being said, the man wakes up and he tells his wife, Honey, you ready to get up, go outside and shoot a deer so we can gut it and peel the skin off? And make pork chops out of it? Yes, honey, of course. Let's do it. I love you. You see? That's the kind of woman I need. The woman that wake up in the morning, want to go shoot a deer, you know, gut it, pull its skin off. <laughs> That's the kind of woman I want. Heck, man, I can't even get a woman to flip a tortilla. You know, I could be doing 
the morning show and I go, honey, honey, se está quemando la tortilla, can you flip the tortilla? That's pendejo, you flip the tortilla, hey man, the only thing I'm gonna flip is flip you off. Que vieja cabrona. <laughs> the women are going, Robert, you better be careful, Robert. You better be careful, Robert. Okay, I'll be careful, I'll be careful. Good morning, shout out to Cynthia Gonzalez Ramirez, been joining me from Houston, Texas. Been Maria Lopez, buenos dias, buenos dias. Maria Lopez, San Antonio, Texas. Check this out. Fresno, California. Local authorities are asking for help identifying a nearly naked woman. How come I never run across naked women? Anyways, I'm gonna start over again. Local authorities are asking for help identifying a nearly naked woman found wandering down a Fresno, California street Tuesday morning, Tuesday morning, Tuesday morning. The woman's hair was wet when she was found around 3 o'clock in the morning, and she told officers that she was a mermaid. <laughs> that she was a mermaid. The woman who has two webbed toes on both feet told officers that she had been in water in the water, but replied, I don't know. <laughs> she is five foot four and weighs 150 pounds. And... <laughs> Um, and, uh, well, she was arrested, and she was taken to Long John Silver's. There you go. Uh, <laughs> that'd be crazy, right? Hey, baby, I'd be going to the bar. Hey, baby, uh, honey, uh, my name is Bobby. What's your name? I'm a mermaid. Uh, uh okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, do mermaids like to have sex? Sometimes. Okay, uh, <laughs> well, why don't we go back to my place and, uh, you know, take care of business, and after that, uh, I'll drop you off at the ocean. What do you think? Uh, right, right, hey, why not, man, right? Good morning, shout out, good night to Michelle. I mean, this William's enemy from Spring, Texas, in the house. Anyway, people are telling me, Robert, we didn't know you were such a big Astro fan. I am an Astro fan. Really, man, I'm not joking about this. Screw this crap. Spectrum, here in San Antonio, there's not time more than no more. There's Spectrum. They're pissing me off, man. How come we can't get... Houston Astro Baseball here in San Antonio. Man, they're going to make me want to go hold up a Taco Bell. I don't want to have to hold up a Taco Bell. I don't, but I'm, they're going to force me to do that. And you're probably going, Robert, what does Taco Bell have to do with the Houston Astros? I really don't know. I just said it to be stupid. Anyways, it is 7.49 in the morning. Good morning. Uh, I was going to say Tuesday morning. It's not Tuesday morning. It's Thursday morning. Anyways, but really, no lie. I need a woman from Alaska. Somebody who wants to go get a deer. Really, I really, really, I'm, I'm, I'm not blanking that up, man. Mm -hmm. Man, last time I told a woman, oh, hey, honey, baby, corazón, um, will you iron me my pair of pants? No, I mean, she got all bent out of shape. Hey, what do you think I am? I'm not your maid. I'm not your maid. I said, okay, no problem. Just because of that, I'm going to quit taking you to Jack in the Box. Anyways, good morning, Double R Radio. Let's get me going. Let's do something by Zuben Vela, El Coco Rayado. Buenos dias.